Hi, Janelle here from Nelly Belly. I wanted to walk you through the steps of changing your email from on your MailChimp account to fit the new DMARC policies that Gmail and AOL and some of those companies have set in place. If you are using a personal email in your email subscription from setting, then your email subscriptions may not be being delivered to your readers. You want to change that from setting to a domain email. So you would want to do like ours is Janelle at NellieBelly.com or Lynette at NellieBelly.com. We no longer are using our Gmail um, email addresses. And I wanted to show you how to do that in MailChimp. So in MailChimp, this is our dashboard that you're looking at. And you can see some of our campaigns and things like that. When you create your next newsletter, you'll be able to do that in your newsletter. But we wanted to show you the RSS one particularly. So we're going to go into our campaigns over here on the left hand side in the little sidebar there and you want to go into your email RSS driven newsletter and you want to click into edit my internet is a little bit slow today but it'll get there and you're going to see all of these this list of, of different options you can edit we're going to go all the way down to this email authentication and we're going to click on edit and it's going to ask us for what email account we're sending this from. And that's simply where we're going to change that email setting to be our new domain email. And you can see here is all of our information. And right here is that Gmail email account that we don't want to use anymore because of the DMARC policy. So we're going to give that one to Lynette. She'll be so pleased. So we're going to have it come from Lynette at NellieBelly.com. And then you probably can't see down here in the very bottom right hand corner, there's a next button. And we gotta wait for my internet, of course. And it's going to ask us to verify this domain. You're gonna get this whole deal here. And they're gonna send you a code. So you're going you're gonna to go through this process, you're going to get that code sent to you, pop it in here and verify it, and you're going to be all set to go on here. And I'm not going to do that right now. And then I'm going to take you back to your dashboard and show you if you do in fact have a newsletter that you send out, you're going to be creating them every month. But let's just go into one of them and we'll make sure to show you where that's going to happen. You have, again, an edit, you have this list, you're going to be going through this as you create your your um, newsletter and you're once again going to be asked for an email authentication. You're going to be able to do the same thing we just did and change that email. So the next time you change your, you do your newsletter, you'll be able to do it then. So that is the steps you're going to need to take to get that email address changed in your MailChimp settings. It's very simple. Just walk through those simple steps.